Lunacy, Alaska is completely out of my head. I, the town and Alaska are characters, as much as Nate and, and Meg are characters. It's a pleasure to finally meet you. Finally? Yeah, I feel like I've seen you everywhere since I've gotten here. I specifically wanted to show Alaska through the eyes of someone who was completely new. Northern Lights weighs more toward Nate's viewpoint. And now that we've run out of things to say, do you want to have sex? I wanted to make Meg, right from the beginning, I knew she would be very gutsy, sort of a loner, and, and a little bit crazy. Bush pilots aren't common like here in the lower 48, but they're real common in Alaska. And I really wanted to make Meg be the bush pilot. You have to be a little bit crazy to do that. Is that him? Oh, oh, stand down, Charlene. I'm just taking him up to his room. The character of Charlene is very complicated because she's very free with her favors. She believes the man she loved, Meg's father, just walked off and left her alone with this child. And this is her way of just getting that affirmation back. And for Meg, this is disgusting. She sees sex completely different than her mother does. But part of her mother is just very needy. I think Rosanna Arquette, who's such a layered actress, is just great because Charlene is not really a hoe. She's just needy, and this is her way of feeding herself. Looks like it's just you and me. It's a better end of the year than I expected. Well, Eddie Cipriani is going to make a lot of women happy, including me. He's fabulous in this. And I think Leanne Ribes is fresh interesting and that energy level that, that you need to pull off a rough and tumble character like this.